Hello everyone, welcome to this Google Slide tutorial series. This is going to be the first video of the series. So please make sure you are going to watch all the videos in the series so that you will be having a complete understanding of Google Slides. With this, let's understand what is Google Slides. So Google Slides is a simple slide management and presentation web-based free tool to create slides or presentations offered by Google. This is a great alternative to PowerPoint. In fact, it has all the basics and intermediate features of Microsoft PowerPoint. You can add text boxes, various shapes, images, videos, charts, animations, transitions, and much more. So let's see how to set up the Google Slides. So first you have to go to drives, I mean drive.google.com, click enter. Once you click enter, you see you will come to this particular link all right where you will be having the recent documents so if you have opened any google slide documents you can see here and you will see an option here that is my drive and just click on this drop down and here you see you have google slides and if you just click on this arrow or if you just hover through this arrow you will be having an option of blank presentation or you will be having an option of from a template. So first I'll just show you from a template. So template means that there is a pre-existing theme or a set of particular design which you want to import to your presentation. So if I just click on this, let's say if I click on this template, now you see you will be going to this particular screen where you will be having a lot of templates. In fact, it's not too much. I think it's around 30 to 40 templates which are basic templates that are offered by Google. So let's say I want this template. For example, let's say I would like this template. Click here. It will try to import this particular template. And now this particular template is in your particular presentation. So if you want, you can customize this template as per your requirement. And let's say this is my template. And here I can customize it based on my requirement. For example, here I can write Google Slides tutorial. And here, let's say if I just write here, for example, tutorial brain. Okay. So you see here, it is so simple to edit this Google Slide presentation. All right. So I'll just close this. And before closing this, I don't want to save this. Okay. So I just wanted to show you this particular template. So let me just go to this move to trash option so that I can delete this. So if I just click here, you see you have two options that is take out of trash, but I want it to delete. So I'll just click on this, go to slides home screen. All right. So you will come to this particular place where we were initially. And you see here, if you come to this particular place, I mean this URL, you have an option of going back to template gallery. So if I click here, you see if I click here, I have come to the same place that is template gallery. All right. And again, let me just go to my Google Drive. And here, if I click on Google Slides, go through this arrow. And if I click on this blank presentation, I'll be able to create a blank presentation. Or what I can do is I can just go to this particular link that is docs.google.com and click on this plus button to create a blank Google slide presentation. All right. And the first step, what I normally do is I use to set up the aspect ratio. Okay. So what I do is normally if I just go to file, I'll show you, you see here, we have an option of page setup. Okay. So you see here, it is here. All right. Click on this page setup and normally it is 16 is to nine. That is, if you want to work on a white screen, but few people, they prefer this option that is standard. In my case, I used to like white screen. So I just click on this apply button. Okay. And normally I used to give the name of my presentation here. So I'll just give something like this. Let's say Google slides tutorial. And if you want, you can save this in a particular folder. So I normally use to save this in a particular folder, right? So first let me just come here and you see you have an option here that is move. 
So if you just click on this move, you have an option to select a particular folder. Let me just try to create a new folder. So for that, I'll just give here, I mean, I'll just click on this new folder and let me just give folder name. So I'll just say Google Slides Tutorial Series. You just click on this tick button and just click on this move button, right? Now, this Google Slide Tutorial has been moved from my drive to this Google Slide Tutorial Series. So let me just click on this particular link and now you see here you will be into this particular link that is Google Slide Tutorial Series. Okay, you have this particular folder under this My Drive. Under My Drive you have Google Slides Tutorial Series. So even if you come here, if you click on this, you will be able to open the same blank presentation. Now of course I have not added anything at this point. So let me just close this. I can also close this as well. Okay. Now first you can see that this is the interface. So it has options like file, edit, view, insert, format and so on. Right. And I'm going to cover all these in detail in this tutorial series. So please be with me. And you see here, first we have this particular menu. Then we have this toolbar and we can also say this like a ribbon. We have this option that is this particular name that is Google Slide Tutorial. Initially, it will be showing as untitled presentation and if you want, you can rename it. So we have given the name as Google Slides Tutorial and you can save it in a particular folder. And in our case, we have saved it in Google Slides Tutorial series, right? And then you see here, if you come towards the right, you have comment history. So this is all about comment, which I'm going to show you in this particular tutorial series one by one. So what I'm going to do is I'll take or rather I'll create a series of videos and in one of the video I'll share about this comment also and then you have present so when the user or when the person let's say you want to start your presentation then you have to click on this present button I'll show these step by step and then you have the share option that is you can share your google slides with anyone right and then you have this particular area where you will write your presentation. So you see here, it is showing click to add title, click to add subtitle and so on. And towards your left, you have this navigation pane area, right? And at the bottom, you see here, this is the bottom where you can add the notes. So as a speaker, if you want to add this note, you can add here. All right. So this is just the basic introduction about Google Slides. In the next video, what I'm going to do is I'll start by editing the text or adding text and then we'll just see various options which are present here that is under this toolbar and we will try to change the color of the text we will add some font and so on with this let's close this video and I'll see you in the next video where we will be working with texts. Mm -hmm.